Hi guys, quick video just looking at some of the trickier questions when answering about the pressure topic. So if I press play, there's a few questions here. Now the one equation I'm going to refer to for every single um, of the answers, I'm going to use P for pressure equals force divided by area. Pressure is a measure of force, but it's acting over area. So I'll click on that. Pressure is equal to, again, go back to my equation, force over area. Now it gets slightly trickier. A skier wants to pressure on their skis to be as low as possible. So they should choose skis with. So again, I've got pressure and I've got force over area. Now if they want this number to be as low as possible, okay, we need to think, do we need a big area or a small area in order to get a smaller number for pressure think back to the video i did when i was standing in the snow so if i was to put my heel in the snow it was given more it was given sorry yes more pressure because it was the same force over a smaller area okay so i'm going to color this one in fully and when i was Spreading my whole foot over the snow, I'm colouring a bit less. That's an example of having the same force but over a larger area, therefore smaller pressure. So if they want the pressure on the skis to be as low as possible, then they're going to need a big area because a small area would be the wrong thing. Narrow width or a short length. Well, let's just see a big area. Better maths. Dog weighs 200 newtons. So the force is 200 N. And we're going to divide that by the area and we're being told it's 50 centimeters cubed sorry 50 centimeters squared now be mindful that a lot of the time when you're dealing with these equations it's in meters not in centimeters so because it's in these take that off take that off how many times is five going to 20 four is in four and then my unit's going to be n over centimeters squared now when i first looked at this question preparing this video for years i'm in my head, I'm looking for this meter squared, but you got to remember, the question's telling me centimeter squared, and the answers, and the choices are centimeter squares. So in that sense, it's fine to go with that one. Okay, but do check your units. Slightly trickier again. A cheetah bites into its prey. One tooth exerts a force of 320 newtons. The area is 0.5. The pressure of the tooth is... Now, I'm going to leave this equation on for 10 seconds. And then I'm going to show you the answers for 10 seconds. Pressure, force over area. Okay, and there's your question and answers. You can have a go at this yourself on the BBC Bite Size website by just writing in um, BBC Bite Size pressure and having a go. Okay, now you know from your maths lessons, when you are dividing by half, it's going to double. The original value that you were putting into your calculation so it wouldn't be um 160 which is half of 320 that's not an option anyway it's 640 yeah you got five out of five okay so have a go but remember your basics all stem from this equation pressure force over area thanks for watching bye now